Alex, congratulations, man of the match today against Glendovery. Uh, tough match, uh, if anything. Yeah, it really was. We gave them uh, we gave them a bit of a, an easy start, which uh, gave us a lot of work to do. But I think whenever we play at home, we, we feel really confident about being able to score four tries. And as long as we stick to, to what we do during the week, what we see during the videos, and things usually happen, and our backs finish some lovely uh, individual tries, which is, which is always great. Seems like once that first try came, uh, the tails really got up. How confident was the side going forward after that? Um, yeah, like, like I say, it's, it, we're, we're a team that builds on momentum, and if we get front football and build build phases, things things happen. We've got a great back line that, like I say, that can finish tries, and and, and the pack. I think, especially during the second half, where we got them to their scrum got penalties, kicked it to the corner, drove, kicked the points, it just slowed their game down, gave us all the momentum and we got to control the rest of the game, which it was great, great performance, the whole team. Uh, just with the pack, we had Johnny Harris coming today, yeah. he seemed very polished, he made a few busts in the, in the first half, uh, he worked quite well with Joe Duffy, uh, was it good to see someone like that come into the side and, and really just pick Abs up? Absolutely, we've, we're really lucky, we've got we've got a good squad at the minute, it's like uh, Fozzy, he came in as well. Um, and uh, Bowser, he's been playing. So we've we've got we've got a whole team that are all willing to put their hands in and uh, put in a performance. So it's it's positive for the rest of the season. Uh, Tom Calladine moved in uh, ahead of Brent Wilson today. Uh, how did he go at seven? Was he? I thought I thought he had a really good game. He's he's been playing really well. Uh, every single time he comes onto the pitch, he's 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 helping us out. He's getting the game going forward again. And oh, he's, like I say, he's a great great addition to uh, to the team. So we've now moved into the quarterfinals of the competition. Uh, Newcastle waiting for us up at Kingston. Uh, how big is that for us? How much are the boys really going to want to get up there and, and show them top of the table championship side? Well, I've, medal? I've been here for this is my third season now, and this will be the first time we've ever had any any knockout tournament. So look, it's, there's three years never having a game that means win or lose and you're in. So uh, and going up to to Newcastle, we played them just before Christmas, full of confidence and. We put in, sadly, a 40, 50 minute performance. We just need to make sure if we put it all together for 80 minutes, I think something could happen. So it's good. There's genuine excitement in it Absolutely, in, in yeah. the tone. I, I, don't, I don't think Newcastle, don't get me wrong, they're, they're a very good team and it looks like they're going to finish top of, uh, top of our league, but they're definitely not unbeatable. And I think if there's any team in, in our league to do it, I think it's definitely us. So. At the moment, just with the British and Irish Cup, uh, we've strengthened all the way through the pool. We've topped the uh, group now to go through the quarterfinals. Just how serious are we taking it? Do you think this is a club, this is a side that can push all the way? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Like I say, we've, we're lucky that we've got we've got a good squad and we can rest a few players and obviously uh, we've got a big a big month coming up. We've got a lot of games that are important in the league as well. And with a good squad, we're capable of being able to put, put in a performance every single week in the league and in the cup. So yeah, it's very exciting. Just looking at that juggling act, we're now coming up against Plymouth uh, in a week's time. That's a hugely crucial match to us considering the last time out we, we lost to London Scottish and then followed that up. Uh, the match against Jersey didn't go ahead. How much are you guys really just biting, chomping at the, the bit to get back into the championship action? Oh, well, I suppose the biggest biggest goal for the team this this year was to always get into the top four and every single home game is essentially we need to win so yeah coming getting back onto it this has helped out we did do a couple of things wrong which hopefully we're going to look at and uh, build those for next week but I think I've said I've said this that whenever we come and play at home everyone's really confident we're it's a nice firm deck and we love to play here and look I think pretty much every time we play here we we want to score four tries and I don't think Plymouth are going to make any sort of uh, attempt at getting four against us. So it's going to be good. Oh, Plymouth. 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 Plym